What is going on guys? Thanks for checking out this video, my sports gematria. Just want to go over the non-exclusive notes I posted publicly for everyone on Saturday about the NBA 2K20 player tournament. Uh, on Saturday there was four players left in the tournament for the semifinals and finals. Uh, I liked Devin Booker out of the four. And I'm just going to go over why uh, I was favoring Devin Booker um, for the tournament, which he ended up winning. Uh, he swept the whole tournament, is, is what they say. So if you're looking at the screen here, this is my Patreon page. I'm not even logged in, and you can see that. You can see these notes. So it was available to the public. You didn't have to be a part of my Patreon page. You didn't even have to be a part of Patreon to see it. Uh, you just had to go to my Patreon page that day. I had the downloads available for the game numbers and the daily numbers. So that was free as well. Um, and then I had some other people here comment. Um, so let's go over what I wrote here. Um, I didn't see when I posted this up, I didn't see any betting lines on, on Boveda. That's who I usually bet with the sports book. Uh, I'm sure there's other sports books that probably had lines. I don't know. I didn't look for them, but out of the four left standing on the semifinal, Devin Booker had the most interesting numbers. So we're going to go over why I liked Devin Booker. So if you see my other videos, left side is what I call my daily numbers, date numerology, Gregorian, both sides of the Hebrew calendar. And the way I set up the uh, 2K player tournament is I had information up here, so I did some gematria for some words like 2K and NBA 2K tournament, NBA 2K20 player tournament, stuff like that. I did coronavirus, semifinals, and then for the players, first it was Devin Booker. Here's his information right here versus Montreal's Harrell. Here's his information right here. And then the other semifinal game was DeAndre Anton, Ayton, DeAndre Ayton, I think. His information right here and then Patrick Beverly his information right here so I have my game numbers and my daily numbers side by side like I usually do um, and so let's just read this here so out of the four I left standing for the semifinal Devin Booker had the most interesting numbers in my opinion the word Devin Booker some to 177 and today was the 17th day of the seventh month on the Hebrew civil like 177 you know, another great example, if you're not using the Hebrew calendar, if you're not following the Hebrew calendar, you're missing out on some of the most best best connections I've ever seen when it comes to sports decoding on making picks. Hebrew calendar has broken numerous glass ceilings for my, my picking record. If you're not using the Hebrew calendar, you know, I have to question whether you're even a real decoder or not. If you're not using the Hebrew calendar and you're new at this, implement the Hebrew calendar. If you're not using the Hebrew calendar and you've been doing this for, for numerous years, you know, I question I question your abilities hardcore. Um so it's been also, also to add to it, it's been 164 days since his birthday. Devin Booker's. And he of course plays for the Phoenix Suns. He's repping the Phoenix Suns in the tournament. The word Phoenix Suns sums to 164. So 164 days since his birthday, Phoenix Suns equals 164. Um, Devin Booker just happens to sum to 177, it being the 17th day of the seventh month. Those two connections right there, uh, I really liked. And I'll show you here on the game sheet. So I had here Devin Booker, 177. I marked it cantaloupe. Why? Because the Hebrew calendar is cantaloupe. 17.7, or at least that's the color that I put it as. And then Phoenix Suns here, 164, it being 164 days since his birthday. Uh, today had 55 date numerology on the Gregorian, and he turned 23 years old 164 days ago. And the word 23 sums to 55. His player ranking um, in the game is 86. And today has 19 date numerology, 19 sums to 86. And this, of course, is a tournament in place of the COVID-19 pandemic. So let's look at the numbers on the number sheet. 
So it's player ranking, 86, 23, so 164 days since his 23rd birthday. Phoenix Suns equal 164. And on the Gregorian calendar, it just so happened to have 55 date numerology and 23 sums to 55. So 164 days since his 23rd birthday on date numerology of 55, 23 equals 55. Him repping the Phoenix Suns 164. Devin Booker wins the tournament on the 17th day of the seventh month, like 177. Devin Booker, 177. It was his day for sure. Devin Booker was the only player out of the four. Devin Booker, Montrell's Harrell, DeAndre Ayton, Patrick Beverly. Out of the four, Devin Booker was the only one that actually connected to the Hebrew calendar. It being the 17th day of the seventh month, Devin Booker equals 177. And, and that's my primary reason why I liked him. And then, of course, the, the 164, it being 164 days since his birthday, Phoenix Suns equals 164. And uh, so Keenan added some things in here. I didn't know Ronnie Craig, I didn't know they had a um, a moderator, somebody to talk in between games. Um, and Keenan was like, Ronnie Krager, Ronnie 2K was his name. Ronnie Krager 2K, Ronnie Singh. Um, Ronnie Singh equals 165, uh, which he found it was interesting because, again, it was 164 or total span of 165 days since Devin Booker's birthday. So, t so the day that he played was his 165th day of his age. And the moderator, uh, Ronnie Singh equals 165. I also liked how if you put in Ronnie 2K into the Gamachinator, uh, it's some to 105. And I was trying to find this connection, and I couldn't find it beforehand. And I didn't, I didn't notice it until Keenan brought up the Ronnie 2K part. But Ronnie 2K equals 105, and it ended up being Devin Booker in the finals, which is the number five seed for the tournament. And DeAndre Ayton, which is the number 10 seed. So 10 seed versus the 5 seed in the finale. Ronnie 2K, 105, like 10 versus 5. 10 seed versus the 5 seed. Um, and then I added some notes here after it's all over. Devin Booker, he, he swept the entire tournament. Winning every single game by double digits is what they said. The words double digits equals 55. The word sweep equals 23. Again, today had 55 date numerology, and he was currently 23 years old. 23 equals 55. Uh, and then Keenan added uh, the Phoenix Suns and the coronavirus. Keenan had both Phoenix Suns in the finals. I don't know if he had a finals pick. Um, I just know that he liked both Aiton versus Bucker. He just liked the Phoenix Suns versus Phoenix Suns matchup. Which makes sense because, again, Coronavirus 56, Phoenix Suns 56. Aeton was 263 days from his birthday, which is the 56 prime. And then, of course, we have Devin Booker, who was heavily connected to the Hebrew calendar. 17-7, Devin Booker 177. Hopefully this makes sense, guys. Quick one run through, semi-quick. Um, actually not quick at all, about 10 minute video. All right, well, hopefully this helps guys. Have a great day. <laughs>